wedding weekend wait a minute it's friday <sighs> already got saturday on the brain i have two weddings this weekend i have one today one tomorrow today's wedding was a later start typically i am up and out of the house by like 6 a.m for a majority of my weddings today's wedding i don't have to be there until 9 45. I'm doing The Bride and Three Guests, which is music to my ears. I have a second stylist helping me out, my girl Hillary, so she's gonna be doing five guests tomorrow's wedding. I am down in Center City and it is a little bit more of an earlier start. So today's drive is only about an hour and 15 minutes, which is not really far. We're getting ready at her parents' house and I am so excited. Some of the things I did last night to prep for my wedding is I always set my alarm. I set three alarms for my wake up, when I need to be in my car, when I need to actually leave so that way just in case i'm wrapped up with my dogs or distracted the alarms will go off and i'll know get in the car time to go i packed my kit left it in my car it is ready to roll i filled up my gas last night because we got to stay safe out here typically i'm up so early i'm not going to be at a creepy gas station filling up be safe i also always look to see how far my drive is so that way i know when i need to get up and since today is a friday i check for traffic so i'll check like my exact location where I'll be going the route I'm gonna be taking 95 which in my area can get pretty backed up in the morning it's around 8 a.m. so it can get pretty backed up so I want to make sure that I leave a little bit extra time for that let's get this day started did I pass by the house and accidentally miss it and now I have to turn around absolutely I did just arrived I'm about like 10 minutes early so I wanted to share with you guys some things that I like to do before I go in for a bridal party especially if I'm early I'm running late sometimes i don't do this however i just like to take a couple minutes to myself drink my protein shake that i have and just take a couple minutes to prepare myself to go into a really hype bridal party so i want my energy to be hype and ready to go so i try to take a couple minutes to let go whatever has happened within the drive up until i walk into my client's front door hotel room bridal suite whatever it is whether that's somebody made me mad while i was driving i don't want to go in in with any kind of negative energy I am a very positive person I want to go in there with that positive energy so no matter what happened I like to sit in my car take a couple deep breaths and just repeat to myself I am so lucky that I get to do this this is my job and then I'll likely blast on my radio like some Cardi B some pump up music just to like get me in the feels get me in the vibes so that way I'm hype and ready to go I'm gonna try to film for you guys still a little awkward bringing out my camera so I hope I can film some stuff and fun stuff for you I'll see you guys in there <laughs>
Okay, just wrapped up that wedding. Of course I went to Chick-fil-A. 
Southwest salad, spicy Southwest salad, delicious. It's my go-to. That was seriously such a fun bridal party, especially for my first wedding back after being off. I sound like a broken record. Yeah, I was off. We get it, Marissa. Nobody cares anymore. Seriously, such a fun bridal party. Her parents and a lot of her fam, her, most of her family was from London. Her dad came out in an apron that had like the naked guy with the speedo on it, and he was serving everybody like the cutest little finger foods. It was just such a good time. Had so 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 much fun with that bridal party we actually switched up her hair a little bit from her bridal hair preview we didn't put the gems in it she's doing a second dress so she wants to put that in later and we did it a little bit tighter than we did it at the trial which is totally normal i feel like everybody wants to change something after their trial on their wedding day totally normal so after weddings my first stop is always chick-fil-a or Chipotle if I'm feeling kind of crazy. That's when I sit in my, now I'm sitting in my car, we're gonna decompress for a little bit. 99% of the time, I'm gonna post my client, my client's photos on Instagram. I'll pay my second stylist so that I can wrap up for the day. And then I get to prep for tomorrow's wedding. So the, the rest of today, I'm going to go to the gym right from work. I'm going to be heading there right now. So I'm going to post on my stories, wrap up my day of weddings today, go to the gym, then go home and get ready for tomorrow's wedding. Thanks so much for spending your day with me and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.